All right, it's my first day back in the stew. They said I'd never learn how to make rhythms. They were wrong. I didn't know about MIDI. I was so naive. I'm putting 808s on everything. Check this out. Now we're gonna put a little bit of delay, change the sound. I want it to be a little beep, beep, boop, boop, beep, beep, boop, boop. All my life I wanted to make music like Play Radio Play. It's funny that he had a project after called Analog Rebellion. I guess he was tired of computers, but I'm like the opposite. I'm gonna have to make a uh, project called Digital Rebellion. I'm gonna avoid playing guitar by any means necessary, which means that today I'm going back in to continue inspecting these tracks, MIDI, fucking EQ, fucking compression, fucking delay, fucking harmony, plug-in. I like to work in peak performance windows. I don't wanna burn myself out, so I'm gonna move on to the next track. Vocals are muted, of course. One thing about maintaining peak performance in the lab is making sure to take walks and eat food. This isn't something that I do well as much as I want to keep sitting in my stew and making the worst bass line of all time that sounds like a frog jumping on a lily pad and extremely hungry. So yeah, I'm gonna get back into the stew later. I'm gonna be working on these tracks all day long till the sun goes behind the sky and there's nothing but darkness that remains. So this is a song that I just found. I just started dressing it up. I think it sounds better like way faster. So I'm gonna try and remember how to play it. I literally don't think I've played guitar once since I came back from tour. So I hope I still know how. Got it. It's just like that. I had to do a few scratch takes of this guitar before I lay my head down. I think this could turn into something really nice. Can't believe I'm playing guitar. This is kind of exciting. I never thought this day would come. Okay, that'll work. Never give up. Ever. Okay, I'm feeling pretty excited about this actually, mostly because the fact that I was able to figure out what that guitar part was and replay it makes me feel like I'll probably be able to figure out the guitar parts of other songs. So I'm just gonna call it for the night. But let's take a little short listen. Hey, yo, this ain't the way this song goes, but I'm gonna rap anyway. You already know I'm chilling with no clothes. I'm in the studio with paper rows. Slaps for sure. So let's see how this guitar sounds by Morning Light. I don't feel like singing yet, so I'm gonna add some like synth or something, maybe a little banjo. And I'm also gonna kind of rearrange the drums a little bit. You know the vibes, fucking Mario 64. Just showing up to the Mushroom Kingdom and you're wondering if maybe you're gonna save the princess. Or actually, I, th I feel like when you hear this, you don't actually even know the princess has been kidnapped yet. I got the synth sound sounding cooler. I also added a little something on the chorus of this song. I had to move the stew to bed. I realized if I just brought the stew in here, it would fix things. I've been making major progress. I couldn't have done it in the studio today. I don't know why. This shit is sounding hard as fuck. No one seems to be around. Right when I was beginning to feel triumphant, my computer keeps crashing because I guess I put a little too much sauce on this track. So I gotta do a recurring dream. It's 6.41. I think I'm gonna work until about 7.30 and then I'm gonna kick back and vape.
Okay, it's exactly 7.28. I think I'm gonna call it quits for the day. I opened up the reoccurring dream session. You could hear the demo for that song on YouTube. It's called The Look on Her Face, Like a Reoccurring Dream. The version on YouTube is just the acoustic voice memo from when I first wrote it, but I wanted it to be this crazy banger. So what I did was I had this drum machine pattern, one that I made on the uh, pocket operator, and then I laid this kick and snare over the top it slap harder when she walks, it's all right that's it so I'm gonna call it so I don't go crazy I'm happy with this I did exactly what I said I would do on my list I used to drink white cloths on up the guy seven now I'm gonna go in and actually just move these little fucking midi things around. I've literally only been doing this for like five minutes, but I'm already very annoyed, but I only have a little bit more I to go. Okay, I'm stepping back out. I could feel myself slipping into a hunger and studio-fueled psychosis. I woke up at like 7 a.m. I was just so excited to get in the lab. I couldn't sleep, drank a bunch of coffee, vaped a bunch, ate one yogurt. So I'm gonna go down and get some food, get a shit ton of bubbly water. I'm trying to get these songs listenable enough to make a secret playlist to see if they truly could be an album. It's done. So I'm gonna send it off to be mixed. This is the worst part. I'm trying to just make sure all these vocals are chill. I hadn't- No one seems to be around me. I hadn't really thought about it too much. I mean, I've comped them a little bit, but I'm so used to hearing them. I don't, I don't know if they're good or bad. I think they're good. No one's fucked up. 